Hello guys and uh, welcome to this new video. So we play against uh, Dropstone from Russia an IM 2446 on the ICC so it's a, an high rating for the 3 minute pool. Uh, he's in the in the in the top players in the best players as, as we say. I guess it's the best uh, 20 or 25 players. So uh, we will get a Meran. Uh, let's try to bring bishop to f5 here. Uh, okay, e6, queen b3, queen b6. Uh, okay, you wanna attack this bishop? Okay, if you wanna attack it, take it. No problem. So, bishop d6. Okay, let's go to the end game. I mean, you play c5, I take the queen, bishop c7, pawn a6. Okay, if you don't take it, don't take it. It's okay. So, c5, queen takes, pawn takes, bishop c7. Okay, he doesn't go in it. So, now he's threat c5. And this would be a free, a free piece. So let's go queen c7. Maybe not the best move because for rook c1, maybe I have to play rook c8. Uh, yeah, I have to take care because uh, he, he would have some take take and knight b5 if my queen wasn't protected a new time. So I need to protect the queen and maybe queen b8 is coming next. Though this pawn structure is uh is kind of annoying. Uh, the thing. Is that my queen and my bishop are hitting to a wall, um, at least for the moment. Maybe some knight g4 can come, and um, I'm attacking the pawn on h2, and after h3 I go knight takes f2. Might that be an option, and then bishop g3? Maybe it's a bit too much, but knight g4, h3, bishop g3 would be marvelous. Uh, okay, it doesn't give me time to play that, unfortunately. So if bishop g3, pawn takes g3, the f pawn, rook takes h2. Rook takes h2, queen takes g3, rook f2, knight g4, and knight d1. And my attack is over. Shame, this was beautiful. Bishop g3, pawn g3, rook h2, take, take, queen here, king here, knight g4, knight d1, knight to f6, then knight to e4. Can we try that? I mean, if it's working, it's a beauty price. At least in the ICC. Check. So I trade ring another knight. <coughs> Going for the ICC beauty price. If it works. Ship to B4. Knight to E4. Let's... Uh, Let's keep attacking this rook. Um, I gave up a lot of material here. And uh, it seems just not to be enough. This is just not going to be enough. I thought it would it would end up like that, but uh I felt I had to try for the fun. Sometimes playing in videos makes you makes you try some uh, some crazy things you would not play if not. But I want to entertain the people watching. So we are two pieces, a piece and a hook down. <laughs> in fact, uh, so it's a lot of material. Queen g5, he just goes away with its stroke. So I might take, take on f2 and take on e3. Just grabbing pawn. So four pawns for the for two pieces. It's a bit too much. It's not a hot chess game. It's just a normal chess game. But still, let's try to, let's try to keep fighting. So he has to take, take, and rook h1. No, he doesn't. Let's go. Uh, let's go king to f6. Knight g4 check. King e7 back. Okay, rook h4. Uh, okay, no tactics available. Still, he's a bit shaky. He's a bit shaky. 
It's not that easy as it should be for him to win it. Because it should be a lot easier to win this type of position with black. And uh, he seems to be a bit scared. Knight f7, I need to push g5. 28 seconds, so maybe we're, we're doing something here. At least it's a 50 50 situation almost now, because it's easier to play with pawns. Pawns are just marching. The pawn is just marching on you. Rook h2. Time is getting better. Time warning. Oh, this is beautiful. Whew. Still, a lot of things might, might, might happen. Okay. Uh, pawn to g3 here. Let's tag. Okay. Check. I think we are just falling short. Check. Oh, Check. We would have this out better. Check. 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 Yes! Yes, we got him! Ooh, we got him! What a game! What a game! <sighs> that's that's kind of something. That's kind of something. Of course, the sacrifice is, is, is not right. And, uh, and well, I mean, I maybe don't deserve to win. So g3, so as I said, uh, if, if, you, if you play c5, take, take, bishop c7, uh, b4, seem to be good because I have no time to play a6 as b5. So I, I thought it would try something like that. Uh, or even now, the c5, uh, take, 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 b4, b5. He didn't, so he went queen c2, queen c7, rook c1. So as I said, now he threads some pawn takes, pawn takes, and knight b5. So I protect my queen, pawn c5, and here I don't know. I felt I felt in the mood to take, give up a second one, check, give this check, bring this knight here, and bring knight to f6. But I was pretty sure he had the defense, but I I wanted to go with that. I mean. It's not every day you have a chance to stret a hook and a piece uh, to try to add up some pressure on the rook. So queen d3, no, bishop b4, knight e4, and, and queen e2 to bring the queen to f3 was the right, right idea to defense. King d7, queen f3. I'm trying to keep the queen on the board. Oh, and he misses queen f7. It's not that obvious to see. It's hard to find an attacking move while you are defending. So queen f7, not an easy move to find, but it was checkmate in 7. So queen here, take, 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 and take on e3. So it was my only way to thread those pieces. I have those four pawns against two pieces. I mean, it's nothing. 30 seconds down, but it's annoying to play. Not f5. So every time I think he could just take, take. And rook g1, bringing the... I mean, I have to play, let's say, uh, rook here. Bishop d2. And... Uh, I mean, with the bishop on the dark squares and this e5 square for the knight, it should be pretty easy to win. He didn't want to take it. I felt he didn't want to take that. Uh, here I was pretty sure I would take, take, and, and rook h1. Uh, again, it's really hard, like rook g8. Uh, okay, maybe I would try rook g8 to put g5. But I mean, again, it's the same idea, just bring the bishop, and uh, those dark squares are so bad. At some point, I mean, I don't know, at, at some point, uh, and let's say he plays like that. At um, some points, I'm, I'm forced to push the pawn. If I push this pawn, he could go knight g4, knight e5. Uh, if I push the other pawn, uh, he could go bishop f4 with the pawn on g4. So, I mean, it's pretty much nothing. So, rook g1, king f6, b4, rook h4. So now I'm attacking the pawn. Rook g4, rook h5, rook f4, king e7. And I was always trying just to push my pawns. So now knight h6, I really want to push now. Finally, I can push. Okay, so I played a few moves, but I went knight, knight, step seven, and push g4. So now, I mean, I have this pawn structure, probably has to play bishop f4. Uh, that is a combo move, by the way. I didn't see that while I offered it. And, and really blocked me on the dark squares. And uh, I'm, I'm really hard to, to, push, to push my pawn further. 
So he went uh, bishop d3, rook h2, rook g4, a very beautiful tactic. Now if I take on f2, he takes on g5. And uh, if I take on g4, he takes back with a, with a fork. But I could take, take, and maybe take on d2. But he takes, I take back, he takes on c6, and he goes bishop to a6. Then take this pawn, probably it's enough to win. So I want to keep the pieces on the board, because uh, I want to play the clock now. So rook f4, knight d2, he takes back g5, now he cannot play knight g4 check because of, of, of the pin. So I can push, bring the king, push the pawn, rook f3, here I win back the piece. Well here it was already uh, total nonsense, I have no time on the clock. So rook h3, I forgot this bishop is covering the f1 square. So take f1 and Check. here with 6 seconds, he had to produce the win. It's not that easy. It's not that easy because my, my, my pawns are like shielding. Of course computer gives checkmate in 5, but it's not easy to, to do. So e4 again, I'm shielding. So he has to probably go queen f6 here. Check. And uh, maybe somehow like that, Check. he's at least pushing my king backward and maybe it's easier then to, to find the, the checkmate ideas. It's harder to checkmate the king in the center. Here, queen d4 is really strong. Check. Pushing, pushing the king. Check. Give a check and give checkmate. a checkmate. So that was a way to do that. Check. It's queen e7, he give up the rook and now it's check. harder to do. So here I felt, you feel there is a checkmate in a couple of moves, but somehow those pawns are really protecting a lot of squares, check. like queen d4, king c2, and maybe bring the king, that's what the easier way to do, and, and queen c5 check and push the king like that. But when queen b4, check. e3 check, king e1, f3, so still no checkmates available. Check. Give a check. On peut avoir du Sorry. Check. So you're a check. King e4, queen b4, d4, and uh, well, he just uh, he just uh, just lost on time. I mean, nothing to analyze. Just I want to show you there was uh, it was not that obvious to to make uh, to make the the checkmate. So thank you for watching the video. Don't forget that you can like the video, share the video, comment the video. You have a lot of things you can do after watching it. So just take time. Put a like, share it on your Facebook, and uh, add up a comment to say what you thought about this game and this crazy sacrifice. Thanks for watching it. Have a nice day. Bye.